With a signal from the conductor, the engineer responds by ringing the bell, releasing the brake, and opening the throttle. At southbound ACR passenger train number two, with engine 205, GP38-2, built in 1981, and engine 170, a GP7, built in 1952, depart over on their way back to St. Marie. We begin our journey across Ontario. Fair on the side of the passenger car, along with its footprint. Ended gondolas are also used to carry pulpwood. The large green cars we see are specially constructed wood chip cars used to transport wood chips from the sawmills along the railway to the paper mill in the Sioux. You will notice the operator handing, or as we call it, pooping the orders to the KLN crew. again see engine 200, but this time with engine 170, as the southbound freight departs first on its way to interchange tonnage with the CN at Oba. It seems as though they are hauling mainly forest products today. the 
same pair of engines, this time as they are heading back to the Sioux from the Agawa Canyon. The first car behind the engine is a former Burlington Northern steam generator car, made from an old steam engine tender. in the Algoma Simple Yard at Oba. A Via passenger train number 106, the three manufacturers Via engine 6308, formerly CN FB9 6521, built in 1955, makes its way towards the station. Bridge at Mackay on the campus facing stuff is our next team. As an extra wet, the engine 1395, an SW 1200 RS built in 1960, makes its way towards Perth. train number 891 with engine 9625 on the head end holds the Alderdale mainline at Nipperson, while southbound unit or train number 770 with engines 9584, 5275, 9615, 5043, and 9481 pull through on the new market truck. This 80 car ore train coming from the iron ore mines of Sherman and Adams is on its way to a steel mill in Hamilton. Passenger train number nine passes by us. A trio of locomotives meet a train at Bear on the York subdivision. The York subdivision runs from the McMillan Yard to the Kingston subdivision. see one of Gold Transit's trains go past us at the Star Scarborough Stop on the Kingston subdivision. Followed closely by a Via LRC train. Via 6524 crosses over the West Toronto Diamond. of RDC head toward Toronto Union Station. An extra east from 
car news Toronto is Ford Georgetown with CN engine 9402, bring and trunk engine 6417, and CN 9404. Notice the special cars used to haul the trailer. via train number 80 with LRC unit 6903 as it pulls into Silver. Silver is the junction between the Guelph and Halton subdivision. After switching the St. Mary's cement plant, rebuilt engine 4100, formerly CNGP9-4257, heads towards its home terminal of Stratford. Sub, as an extra east with MLW RS-18, 3129, built in 1959, 4476, a GP-9 built in 1956, and MLW M-636, 2307, head towards Stratford with a train of hoppers loaded with salt. Diamond, just west of London, is their next location as a train of agricultural products with engines 9463, 9407, and 2307 head towards London. Engines 3550, 3502, a pair of MLW M420 pull into the west end of Belleville Yard. and MLW built 2021 as they head towards Belleville Yard. and two Leafs B&O engines 3725 and 3706 pass by on their way to London. With two 
66-22 in the points, followed by CP 54-14 and 54-13. Both formerly Quebec North Shore and Labrador SC 40, 218 and 217, built in 1971. An extra passes over the middle Thames River. Again, we are at the CNCP Diamond just west of London, but this time we see a CP Freight with CP engines 5511 and 5504, along with Leaf GATX 5070 as they cross the diamond. Lampton Yard to Agent Court Yard heads towards the West Toronto Diamond with the following engine concept. CP5412, another former Quebec North Shore and Labrador engine. 3739, at least CNRS 18. CPSC40, 5554, and CPSW1200RS 1249, formerly CP8168. on this freight at Rumford, which is just east of Sudbury. The engines are MLW C424, 4248, built in 1966, MLW RS18, 8777, built in 1958, and MLW RS18, 1833, rebuilt in 1985, and formerly 8795, built in 1958. with CP5993 and 5907, a pair of SP40-2, along with Lee's Chessie 3840. Head passenger train number two. See a passenger train number two with F40PH-2, 6408, built in 1986, and F9B6620, formerly CN6620, built in 1957, makes their way towards Duffery. CPSC40 
SC40-2, number 5980 and 5556, make their way up the High Falls Hill on their way to Cartier. day in 1985 on the High Falls Hill, an extra west 3040, a GP38-2 built in 1983, and helper engine CP G5A-1201, the last steam locomotive built by Canadian Pacific, makes her way west to the last bike ceremony and then on to Expo 86. backdrop of some of Northern Ontario's beautiful scenery, we take our last look at GP Rail, with engines 5940, 5734, 5835, the trio of SC40, make their way west. February morning as Ontario Northland's 1984 Northlander train set with former FP7A 1519 makes its way towards Toronto. A short train with GP38-2 1800 heads towards New Lister. and 1730, a pair of SC40-2 locomotives built in 1973 at northbound freight number 213 on its way to Engelhardt. In 1734, heads out of Miracle Falls with a train of loaded paper cars from the Abbott Tippy Price paper mill.
again we see 1734. Northbound freight number 213 head towards Cochrane and interchange with CN Rail. Look at the different types of freight cars on this train. Engines 1801, a GP38-2 built in 1974, an FC7A engine 1520 built in 1953 as they head north to Moosonee and James Bay with Ontario's last regular mixed trains. <laughs> 